and what is up guys welcome back to Accelerate Yourself for another video sorry for the delay I know it has been a little bit since I posted a video I'm pretty busy over the last weekend as you can see we are officially in the new digs we, uh, we brought the wall of power with us set it up right between the two doors uh, gotta say looking at it on camera now I don't know if it's the most level uh, hanging job I've ever done in my life but uh, you know what we're just gonna we're not gonna sweat the details but anyways we're officially all set up in the new digs got a nice little home office going in here Tons of space, accelerators, and Highway 35 cars absolutely everywhere. And before we jump into today's video, huge shout out to everybody who was in the Hot Wheels Unleashed tournament. That was not this past Friday, but the Friday before that, so like two Fridays ago. It was absolutely tons of fun. Uh, we actually had a really good turnout. We had 10, 10 racers, I believe. It was pretty good competition. Uh, I think Rubicon ended up coming out on top. Shout out to him for winning the tournament. And I believe Maurice was right behind him in second, and then Darth was in third. And then the rest of us were all just kind of in distant... Uh, fourth, fifth, and beyond. So shout out to Rubicon for coming in first place in the Hot Wheels Unleashed tournament. We're definitely gonna have a lot more tournaments and sort of fan contests on the channel coming soon. Um, we're gonna be announcing another contest that we're doing later this week. I'm not 100% sure if it's gonna be coming on Wednesday or Friday, but at some point this week, we're gonna announce it. And then we'll probably have one more contest that we'll do before we do another Hot Wheels Unleashed tournament. We're gonna kind of keep these, uh, these three different types of competitions. We're gonna kind of sort of cycle through them over the next couple months. If they are a hit with you guys, we'll just have to sort of play it by ear and see how it goes. But anyways, over the last week during my hiatus from posting videos, uh, we actually broke the 1100 subscriber mark. Huge shout out to you guys for getting us up over 1100. And it's kind of funny, when I first started making Accelerators videos, I really did think that the channel would be capped out at like four or 500 subs. I really didn't think there was just that many people that were interested in YouTube content on Accelerators to uh, make it really worthwhile and making like a long-term channel. But uh, then I sort of started finding some of the other Accelerators YouTubers, you know, like uh, JC, uh, Tesla's Cube, um, Vulcan's got a ton of subscribers and I was kind of like, wow, maybe there is more interest than I thought in accelerators, but, uh, I still was kind of seeing really slow growth of the first, you know, 50, 100, 200 subs. But, uh, here we are now 1100 still growing steadily, but surely you guys are absolutely amazing. Huge shout out to all you guys. Once again, just for always messing with the videos, liking, commenting, subscribing, you guys are the best community in the world for sure. But I know you guys aren't here to listen to me prattle on and on. You guys are here for the giveaway because you know, every 100 subscribers we hit, we do another giveaway on the channel. And this time we have another custom made by Randy Leahy himself that we're gonna be giving away for you guys. Definitely the coolest custom we've given away so far in my opinion. So huge shout out to Randy once again for supplying these customs for the giveaways for us. You guys are gonna absolutely love it. And just to keep you guys in suspense for a little bit longer, I'm not gonna show you the custom we're giving away just yet. I'm gonna make you guys wait a little bit longer. So let's talk about what you gotta do to be entered into the 1100 subscriber giveaway for this custom. So this time around, as always, you need to be subscribed to the Accelerators Hub. You have to like this video. And then I need you to go down to the comment section for me. And this time what I want to know, hmm, let's see here. So I wanna know out of all of the Accelerators racing realms that did not appear in the movies, that like we didn't get actual footage of the realms because I know uh, like the fog realm, the warped realm, and a couple of the other ones, they technically were included in the movies, you know, the drones won them, but uh, we didn't actually see any footage of them and the Teku and the Metal Maniacs didn't get a chance to win them. So what I wanna know is out of all the realms that did not appear in the movies, which one would you have liked to see footage of in the movie and which driver or racing team do you think would have won it? So for those of you guys who aren't real big into the card game, some of those additional realms include, you know, the Chrome Realm, the Solar Realm, the uh, the Reactor Realm, the Cyber Grid Realm. Um, obviously, you can do like Fog, Warped Realm, because uh, we didn't technically see those in the movie. Then what else? Uh, I might have already said Canyon and Solar, um, Labyrinth. There was a bunch of good ones. So uh, that's what I want to know from you guys. Go down in the comment section. Let me know which of those realms you would have liked to see in the movies and who you think would have won. So for me personally, the realm that I would have loved to see in a movie is the Labyrinth Realm. I absolutely love the whole design, the scheme of the Labyrinth Realm, the whole maze concept is absolutely wicked. And uh, obviously the Maze Minotaur Hazard card, I would have loved to see a Maze Minotaur in a movie beating up on someone's car. We all probably know that it probably would have gone after Vert just based on the way the movies went for Vert. But that is the realm I would have liked to see. It would have been the Labyrinth Realm. And if I had to pick a winner, Honestly, I probably think that Karma Ice would have won the Labyrinth Realm just because of her analytical style to driving. I feel like she would have figured out a pattern. Or, you know, well, Karma would probably be my favorite, but there could also be sort of a, a reverse uh, twist to it where Ver just realized that he could use his jump jets to uh, just sky over all of the uh, the walls in the Labyrinth Realm, and he could have won that way. So that's also a very real possibility, but uh, I would have to say Karma Ice would have won the Labyrinth Realm. So that is my pick. Be sure to go let me know down in the comments which realm you would have liked to see and who you think would have won it. And now let's take a look at the custom that Randy sent us to give away. So I've made you guys wait long enough. The custom that we are giving away for this giveaway, one of my favorites that I've ever seen, is a Holofoil Chicane Custom, guys, with the green rimmed 
CM6 is absolutely beautiful. Look at the shine on this chicane car. And just look at the detail on the hood of the car. Look at that. Look at those decals. Absolutely gorgeous. Cannot get over that shine and that sparkle, guys. Just look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Looks like it's using the Cavern Realm Accelo Charger. It is absolutely lit up in the light. And it just gets cooler and cooler the more you look at it. Absolutely gorgeous. Love that it has Teku instead of Utec on the sides. Just unreal. It really is a breathtaking car and it's just absolutely smooth and glossy to touch. It is incredible. It feels just like a mainline acceleracer car. So that is the prize for the 1100 subscriber giveaway. Huge shout out to Randy Leahy for sharing this custom with us. Absolutely gorgeous, guys. Just look at this car, the detail on it. So hopefully you guys are all stoked to win this Hyper Chicane custom car. Absolutely gorgeous. And I'm going to leave the description to... Or I'm going to leave the link to Randy's eBay page down in the description of the video. If you guys are looking for more customs by him, go click the link, save his eBay page, be alerted whenever he releases new customs because they sell like hotcakes the second he lists them. But that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. I'm not going to tell you to like and subscribe because you're already liked and subscribed if you're entering the giveaway, right? Just common sense there. But uh, anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up. Hopefully you guys all have a great Monday and I'll catch you all later in the week. Peace out, guys.